Free meals and new toys. It's a Christmas Eve tradition in Berlin that always draws a crowd. News 13's Amanda Goodman is in the Newsplex with that story. Well, as times get tougher, more and more people are coming out to the Berlin Christmas dinner where you can always find a friendly face and forget your troubles, at least for a little while. It's delicious. Tamales, turkey, and all the trimmings, a holiday feast. For us to be a part of this is a really true blessing. Um, for my family here, um, we're not doing all the best right now, but, you know, we're, we're trying to get through it just like everybody else. And for at least today, the Wilkes family is getting through it with other families here at the 14th annual Salvation Army Christmas dinner, where all the food is either donated or made from scratch. And I think that's what makes it more enjoyable because it's like home, and we all eat together as a family. Yvonne Salazar is the founder of this dinner. The giving part is the, the, my favorite, and seeing the children smile, they are just so excited. Excited because this dinner also includes a visit from the man in red. And a new toy that means they'll have something to play with come Christmas morning. It means everything. Um, it's, it's what we're here for. You couldn't ask for anything more. Making spirits bright while reminding us all what the holiday season is truly about. And they saw their biggest crowds ever today, but there was still plenty of food and toys to go around. Mike, back to you. Okay, thanks, Amanda. The dinner was originally started in a parking lot of the Lady Hawk feed store, but eventually moved into the Rio Abajo Lodge, where it is now held.